always sweet and decadent summertime snack. It starts with a beautiful, fresh watermelon, a little bit of lime zest, and of course, our favorite gunpowder spice. This stuff is absolutely incredible. And when I say I put it on everything, I pretty much put it on everything. Okay, this is gonna blow your mind. So we're gonna start with a beautiful, fresh, ripe watermelon right here, and we're gonna cut it into chunks. Now, I like to save the rind and just cut the skin off of it and freeze it for my dogs. It's a really great and healthy snack, a summer treat for those guys. Okay. I've got my beautiful melon already cut up into pieces right here in the bowl. And now I'm going to take a fresh lime right here, cut this guy in half, and squeeze just a little tiny bit of juice all over the melon. Just a little bit, just a little sprinkle. Now, most of the time, people do enjoy like a little bit of salt in their watermelon, and I'm, I'm guilty on one of those people. Um, but this gunpowder spice actually has, you know, some salt in it. It's got some other spices and a little bit of sugar. And yes, even though it's used mainly for savory things, you can totally use it right here. So I'm going to give it a beautiful, generous dusting of gunpowder right there. Just a little bit of lemon zest to really enhance that summer flavor. Then we just give it a toss. Now, this is very similar to um, a very popular kind of Mexican spice that you can find in stores that we like to put on fruit, especially pineapple or anything else. But this is your one stop right here. This gunpowder, you can go from steaks to burgers, to veggies, to fruit. It's just everywhere and it's everything and it's so, Savory, sweet, a little bit of spicy, a little bit of tang. Reminds you of summer. Tastes like summer. Dude, I am so in. Look at that. Beautiful red watermelon. Zesty lime. Gunpowder spice. You can't miss. <laughs> 